Justin Timberlake's attorney denies intoxication in DWI arrest. In response to Justin Timberlake's arrest on DWI-related charges in June, his attorney, Edward Burke Jr., has emphatically denied that the superstar was intoxicated at the time of the incident. Burke stated that the most important fact to know about the case is that Justin was not intoxicated and should not have been arrested for DWI. During a hearing for Timberlake's case, which he did not attend as it was not required, Burke pointed out in the courtroom that prosecutors failed to obtain a superior officer's signature on the initial charging papers. He argued that this mistake should lead to the dismissal of the case. According to Burke, this paperwork mix-up is just one of the many errors made by the Sag Harbor Police. Burke claims that the police made a number of significant mistakes in this case. And the court hearing was an attempt by the district attorney to rectify one of those errors. He acknowledges that the police can sometimes make mistakes, and this is one of those instances. Despite the events that occurred, Burke maintains that Timberlake has respect for law enforcement and the important job they do. He states that Timberlake cooperated with the police officers and treated them with respect throughout the process. The attorney also expresses respect for the entire judicial process, including the district attorney and judge involved in the case. Burke concludes by reiterating that Timberlake was not intoxicated and that there was an error in arresting him for DWI. He expresses confidence that the charge will be dismissed. Timberlake was taken into police custody on June 18 and was issued citations for failure to stop at a stop sign and failure to keep right. The criminal complaint described him as having bloodshot and glassy eyes, a strong odor of alcohol on his breath, slowed speech, and performing poorly on sobriety tests. Timberlake admitted to having one martini but refused to take a breathalyzer test. Despite an eyewitness claiming that Timberlake was intoxicated and drank another patron's unfinished alcoholic beverage, a bartender from the American Hotel where Timberlake was allegedly drinking supported the singer's account. Timberlake is scheduled for an arraignment on August 2nd and is expected to attend the hearing virtually. Thank you for watching and don't forget to click subscribe for more updates on celebrity and pop culture news.